across a lifetime spent in the pursuit of knowledge. She was my greatest discovery. Once a little outcast girl shunned by her tribe, ignorant of her own importance. Through her, I learned the fate of the old ones, wiped out a thousand years ago by their own avarice. Life was only saved by a technological miracle. Zero Dawn, a terraforming system composed of nine subordinate functions, each playing its part to reshape Earth from a barren rock to a verdant landscape with a new dominant species, automated agents of the system, the machines. And with her, I learned the deepest secret of all, the secret of her birth. That she is a clone of Elizabeth Sobek, Zero Dawn's creator, born for a singular purpose, to defeat Hades, the system's emergency reboot function, which was given life and the will to dominate by a mysterious signal of unknown origin. And with a little help from me, she did defeat Hades in a great battle at the city of he has been, now I must leave her behind. For as she strives to put right what Hades sundered, I have made a new discovery. One that requires ruthlessness she would never condone. An enemy more powerful than any we have seen before. I'm running out of time, Elizabeth. The land is dying. People are suffering. Soon, they'll starve. All because of a terraforming system that's spiraling out of control. And only I can fix it. Only I have your genetic code. It won't be long before we hit the point of no return. And then... Extinction. I've been searching for months for what I need. A backup of Gaia. The AI you designed to control the system. 
But every time I think I have a lead, that comes to nothing. And every night, I have the same dream. I'm lost. I'm exhausted. Empty-handed after my long search. The storm closes in. I have to get to shelter. When I finally find refuge, I see you, Elizabeth, waiting for me. Even though you've been dead for a thousand years, you're the closest person I've ever had to a mother. I want, but I never can. This world is your legacy, Elizabeth. I won't let it slip away. The valley below is my only remaining lead. My last hope to find the backup. I'll do whatever it takes to get it. I promise. What are you doing here? If you've been tracking me, then you've seen the signs. The blight, the storms. The world's still in danger, Voral. Beating Hades was only half the job. The other half, well, it's what I was born to do. So I, I figured I should just get to it, you know, I've always been faster on my own. Okay, then. There's something I have to find down in that valley. Everything depends on it. But if you're going to come with me, you'll need to be able to see what I see. It'll help you understand what's really going on. One you wear, the other backs up your data. Information on the device to cover, but we'll have to do it as we go. Since I was a little girl, yeah. Come on. All right, first things first. I got a couple scrapes on the way here. We should find some medicinal plants. Stock up. Well then, it's uh, time for your first lesson with the focus. Let's get started. These plants don't look like the ones in the sacred lands. Use your focus. It'll show you what's edible. There. Those plants by the stream should do the trick. Keep moving. Might, might want to grab more of these plants along the way. Yeah, good idea. Ground stained red. The blight must be infecting the soil. <laughs> I 
I see a few ways down. I'll follow your lead. Going for a swim? Fast. Noticed you're traveling light these days. Yeah, I had to leave a lot of my gear behind. Like they were salvaging something. Let's go take a look. Someone took down this machine recently. Who else would come here? I don't know. Better craft some arrows of our own. There might be trouble up ahead. There's some ridge wood by the river. Now to craft some arrows. Not done. Me too. Arrows ready. There's a ladder, but can't reach it from here. Nothing a well-placed arrow can't knock free. Just have to target the lock. I did it. After you. By the goddess. What was this place? Don't know. The transmission log. It... The... My mother led the rest of the Nord home. What about everyone else? The Sun King put everyone to work rebuilding Meridian. The city took quite a beating in the battle. There was talk about sending a search party after you, but we figured you left because it was important. Guess we were right. Not seeing a way in from here. Let's check around the side of that building. machine ahead. We can take cover in the grass. You're going down. Another one's coming. Another one of those machines. Far Zenith. They traded technology with Zero Dawn, but I thought it was just a copy of the Apollo database. Why would they have a backup of Gaia, too? I guess they want us to check in with them. 
It looks like whoever shot the machine the Glint Hawks were scrapping found another way in. An entire camp of Osram. Wiped out. They must have come here to Dell for scrap. Looks like something big came in from above. Crashed right through the camp, and then out that wall. Any more comments on the snake guard? Whatever came through here brought this down as it went out. If I can dislodge these metal pieces, I should be able to clear the way. Maybe I can find something in the camp. Aloy, over here. I think I got something. Aloy kneels beside an Ozerum corpse. Varl, also kneeling, points to a broken pole caster in the Ozerum's hand. That tool he's holding, attach it to the debris, add a bit of rope. And pull the debris out. That could... This one's broken, but maybe there's another in the camp? The focus can help us search. I can show us if there's anything similar lying around. As she stands, she reaches up and pulses her focus. Varl mimics the gesture. A purple holographic glow appears, hovering above a sack. Machine cable. It's stronger than rope, but it's not the tool. Part of a shell walker. Looks like it has a strong magnetic pull, but I need a tool to attach it to. I might be able to modify my rappel line instead. Turn it into a kind of electromagnetic hook. There's a workbench over there you could use. There. Uh, pole caster. Now to test it on the debris. That's a trick. Another one of those holograms. Well, it doesn't look like there's an easy way out of here. I should scan the area with my focus. Welcome. We have to find a way to, to keep going. Facility tour. Please activate the display. That was easy. That pole caster is useful. Too bad there's only one. Don't worry, I'll find you another way up. The hologram said to activate this thing. Like this? Good morning. I'm Oswald Dalgard, and it is my pleasure to introduce you to Farzina. Now there's been a lot of rumors about us, but the truth is simple. We don't think that our common future should be common at all. We say, reach for the stars. 
Even if you have to cross 8.6 light years of space to get there, please proceed into the auditorium, where we'll unveil our plans. The old ones keep talking to us. It takes some getting used to.
Um, did you see what made the dust cloud? No. Well, whatever it is, it can't be good. 